Now, there are other forms of uh, therapy that people might not even know about, and we'd love to learn about those from you today. So let's start out with motion analysis. What is that? So motion analysis is a tool we have at our facility, and it's basically a camera connected to a computer, and we film our patients in action. So they're doing a specific activity that maybe uh, they have a problem with or they have a deficit with, so we can film it and analyze it, break it down. Um, it allows us to see the patient better and allows the patient to see themselves in action. How does an anti-gravity treadmill work? Okay, so an anti-gravity treadmill is the equivalent of running in water. It's just you don't have to get in the pool. So oh, we have cool. one of these at, at our facility, and we will have one at our Miami Beach facility that's opening up soon. And it's a treadmill um, where the patient puts in these, these special shorts, and they run in air. Um, so wh while they're running in air, it's putting less impact through their body. So let's say a patient had a spinal injury, and they had pain with impact. We can have them run in there with less impact. Or someone recovering from a surgery that's trying to get back to running, we can have them run on that treadmill, putting less stress on, on their injury. Wow, that's really, that sounds really fun, actually, <laughs> to see it being done. All right, here's something else. Um, I've actually had this done for a couple of injuries. Electrical stimulation. Let's talk about what that is and also how it can help with some of the, the back issues that may, you may be dealing with. So electrical stimulation can be used in a variety of ways. Um, but the two main are to make a muscle contract so we can do some strengthening. If there's a weakness that we find, right. um, we can actually um, run some current through the muscle and have it contract for us. And then it can be also be used for pain control. So we think of you know, acupuncture is used for pain control because um, you're able to send signals through that nerve to actually numb it. Electricity is used in the same way, and it's very effective. Okay, yes, like I said, I've had it before. It did help me a lot, so I can vouch for that. Uh, and last but not least, let's talk about Pilates rehabilitation. What's that all about? Okay, so at our facility also in Coral Gables, we have pretty much a full Pilates studio, mm -hmm. and we have therapists that use Pilates to do their, their full rehab. So um, you can basically, with the Pilates equipment, focus on, on the entire body, the core that we've talked about today. Yes. Um, and it's just, um, it's a very safe um, way of rehabbing, and it's a very, um, it's a nice progression to that the patient can continue to do once they finish their rehab.